If you're a fan of Scott Atkins and you don't want to miss any of his movies, his last film One More Shot is worth it to watch. Atkins is a fantastic actor in my opinion, he doesn't get the recognition that he deserves. This guy plays very intense. One More Shot is not the film genre that we're used from him. We won't see spectacular fight sequences with fantastic spinning kicks like in the Boyka movies, Accident Man, Ninja, Close Range or Hard Target. However, there are some really cool action scenes. This movie is more about gunfire, explosions and hand-to-hand -hand combat. The acting from Scott is very admirable. He shows his high-class performance. One More Shot is a sequel to One Shot from 2021. It stars Scott Atkins, Michael Jai White, Tom Berenger and Alexis Knapp. What's the story about? Following the Black Side attack in Poland, Navy SEAL Jake Harris, played by Scott Atkins, must use all his combat skills to withstand an airport siege from mercenaries. These highly armed mercenaries attempt to capture high-profile terrorist suspect Amin Mansour. A bomb has been shipped to the US and will detonate in a matter of hours. Mansour is the only person who may know its location. Harris must protect the man so he can reveal the location of the bomb. One more shot has been filmed to look like a single continuous take. The gimmick adds some real-time energy to the fighting as Scott Atkins fights off a small army of bad guys. This is a B movie and the movie lacks some credibility. Like I said before, you won't see spectacular fight sequences with fantastic spinning kicks like in the Boyka movies. However, the acting performance of Scott Atkins is very intense. Mm -hmm. 